In a world where surveillance is omnipresent and freedom is a curated illusion, George Orwell's 1984 emerges as a chilling prophecy. This documentary delves into the depths of a dystopian society, where Big Brother's gaze is inescapable, and the truth is malleable. Join us as we unravel the threads of Orwell's vision, exploring the dark corridors of totalitarian control and the flickering light of individual rebellion. Welcome to the exploration of 1984, a cautionary tale that remains eerily relevant in our modern world. 1984 is set in a dystopian future, where the world is divided into three superstates that are perpetually at war, Oceania, East Asia, and Eurasia. The novel takes place in Oceania, specifically in a grim, totalitarian version of London, which is part of a larger area known as Airstrip One. In this society, the ruling party, led by the figurehead Big Brother, exercises absolute power over its citizens. Orwell masterfully creates this suffocating atmosphere. Imagine a world where you can't even trust your own thoughts, where the very language you use is designed to limit your ability to rebel. The party enforces its control through a system of omnipresent surveillance, personified by the ever-watching Big Brother. These telescreens monitor every word spoken, every facial expression. Privacy is a forgotten concept. The chilling thing about 1984 is how it reflects real-world anxieties about technology and government overreach. It makes you wonder, how far away are we from a society that constantly monitors its citizens? Winston, a low-ranking party member, yearns for freedom and truth. He secretly rebels by working on a forbidden history project. Winston's act of defiance, however small, is incredibly powerful. It reminds us that the fight for freedom often starts with the right to tell our own stories. The party uses a language called Newspeak to manipulate thought. Words like freedom are redefined to mean their opposite. By controlling language, the party controls reality. Newspeak is a terrifying concept. It reminds us of the power of language to shape our understanding of the world. Winston seeks solace in his love affair with Julia, another rebel. Together, they dream of a world beyond the party's control. But hope in Oceania is a dangerous thing. Winston and Julia's rebellion is short-lived. They are betrayed and captured by the Thought Police. O'Brien, a powerful member of the inner party and a villainous antagonist, subjects Winston to a terrifying form of psychological torture, designed to break his spirit and force him to accept the party's reality. The torture Winston endures is more than physical. It's about destroying his ability to love, to believe in anything outside party control. Winston is forced to betray Julia and denounce his own sanity. He becomes a shell of his former self, a loyal party member who has embraced the lie. In the end, Winston's rebellion is crushed. He becomes a living embodiment of the party's slogan, War is Peace. Freedom is slavery. Ignorance is strength. 1984 was published in 1949, yet it feels more relevant than ever. Today, we live in a world of constant surveillance, government overreach, and the manipulation of information. 1984 serves as a stark warning. It reminds us that we must be vigilant about protecting our freedoms, our privacy, and our right to dissent. The book's themes of totalitarianism, propaganda, and the control of language continue to resonate deeply. The rise of social media and mass data collection raise troubling questions about who controls our information and how it's used. 1984 forces us to confront these issues head on. As we step back into the light of our reality, the shadows of 1984 linger. Orwell's masterpiece is not just a story, but a mirror reflecting the potential consequences of unchecked power and passive compliance. 
It's a reminder to guard our freedoms, question our realities, and challenge the narratives that seek to shape our world. Thank you for joining us on this journey through 1984. May its lessons guide us as we navigate the delicate balance between security and liberty. Before leaving, do like this video and share it with your friends to make them understand the difference between security and liberty. Do subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell to dive deep into the world of books and biographies. See you next time.